hi guys welcome back to my channel hope you're well and eating good i know it's been a long time but i have a delicious recipe for you guys here today super easy as i say with all my recipes and it's going to be part of the cheap 20 series um i think it'll be episode five i think um it's using leftover vegetables in the fridge some sausage polar sausage that i like to use sometimes and it's easy so let's get in so first you want to salt some boiling water always salt your pasta water it doesn't matter what anyone says <laughs> put salt in it and you do not need oil okay all you the only thing with pasta is you have to stir it occasionally and make sure the water is boiling and you'll have great pasta or follow your package instructions okay stir that occasionally and i'm using farfalle because i like the shape but you can use whatever you want okay so next we're using some polish sausage as i said i'll have more about this in my blog post i'm also using some peppers as well as some onion some garlic and some parsley just really little to add in the fridge some chili flake pepper salt and some cream also some cheese that i forgot to show you guys so in a pan you want to add some oil into the pan you can use olive oil vegetable whatever and i like to add a knob of butter a big knob of butter um do this together so the butter doesn't burn on its own and it also adds a nice richness so next you want to add in the onions okay you don't want to add in the onions you want to do the sausages do as i say not as i do um, i accidentally went the wrong way but it's okay everything gets in the pool anyway so season lightly with salt to get some of the moisture out you want to just sweat the onions off and you don't want to get too much color on there um, and just stir fry occasionally on medium heat i'll have all the measurements in my blog post so don't worry about that um now i'm adding in the sausages with the peppers but like i said um it really doesn't matter to be honest but i would have preferred it if i did it the other way so i think i was just not paying attention here so um turn the heat down to medium heat and stir fry well make sure it gets nice and you know cook down and caramelized now i'm adding in the garlic um, i didn't add it earlier because i didn't want it to burn i really like garlic so um i put about three cloves you can put a clove it's up to you everything here is optional you can even make this vegetarian by adding in mushrooms whatever you like okay so stir fry that and then by now your pasta should be about almost cooked you want to save some pasta water in case we need to thin out our sauce and then you're going to drain your pasta um i like farfalle because i feel when if you want to enjoy this dish cold you can and the shapes i just love it especially for a pasta salad and um, that's how i'm seeing it so you add your pasta into the um, mixture which should be nice and softened now the sausage should have a little bit of color on it really simple guys there's not much to it um i feel like as like this dish just takes as long as the pasta takes you know you can even cut your vegetables as the pasta is going which is what i did um and it's just super simple so mix 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 and you can stop here okay you do not have to add the cream and the cheese i know it makes it a bit heavy but you know what's wrong with just indulging sometimes so i really like adding a little bit of cream here but i also do enjoy it on its own okay so i'm gonna add in um single cream you can use double if you want i mean go ahead uh and then also some cheese i think this was parmesan cheese actually yeah i think it was parmesan cheese <laughs> sorry because i'm sure i had a couple of cheese in the house and i didn't know which one to use i didn't want to mix it but you can use whatever you want mozzarella cheddar make it as cheesy or as not cheesy as you like you don't even have to put it in i also added some black pepper which i forgot to show but just look how delicious that is guys it's silky um smooth you want to turn off your heat okay um turn off your heat when you add the cheese so it doesn't split now it's done just sprinkle with some fresh parsley some chili flakes black pepper and oh, just enjoy guys enjoy <laughs> 